The means test is the test we apply to work out whether someone is eligible for legal aid funding for their legal problem, um, which means that they can get a lawyer to help them with it. The National Disability Insurance Scheme and the trial site down here in Barwon, um, I was told that NDIA will not fund anything considered medical, which was um, what um, physio and chiropractic were being classed as. 25% of Australians need a lawyer to help them with a legal problem. 14% of Australians live below the poverty line. Only 8% of Australians are covered by legal aid. A lot of research has been done about the extent of legal need and we know that thousands of people who have legal problems um, don't get the assistance that um, they need to resolve those problems. Often the first time a person comes in contact with the legal system or needs a lawyer is when they're going through a family law problem or they're experiencing family violence and these are areas that legal aid works in. We've had clients miss out on legal help because they might have uh, been able to get work for the first time in months or years but uh, because they're working um, and because of their income uh, they're not eligible. And if they don't qualify for legal aid but they just miss out, they're just earning a little bit too much money, they find it really hard to be able to fund a case. So that's why we need to broaden the base of Victorians that can qualify for legal aid and have some discretion and flexibility in the system to allow them to be funded. What happens if someone isn't granted legal aid? You, just, you can feel completely lost, you feel completely like uh, empty, you're sort of like you don't know where, what direction you're going, you don't know what you're doing, you just walk in there like like a, like a schoolboy, like a little schoolboy lost, lost the school for the first time. You're just like confused, don't know who to look to, who to, who to ask for advice and you don't know what you're actually doing. You're just, yeah, you're very scared. It's a very scared and scary moment, yeah. Just to have had anyone who could have been there in my corner and it could have been walking me through that process to know what to expect, um, it just would have changed everything on that day for me. It's a fundamental right to be able to be represented and that's so important that a person can access a lawyer and have a voice in court. Without the uh, help of legal aid representation down, my, down from my experiences, I don't think I'll be where I am right now. Without their support and their, their generosity, they, I, I, they, they, I wouldn't be the person I am and I wouldn't have the lifestyle that I have right now. Just off drugs, being out of trouble and my own family and st staying, staying clean. A bit stuffed without legal aid, really. Did you or someone you know miss out on legal aid? Tell us your story. Share your ideas.